I'm Paul with Paul Steven Photography, and today we're going to show you how to set up basic portrait lighting. Well, here we are in the studio, and we're going to do some basic portrait lighting for you. I'm going to put my light meter away, which is always a good thing to have, so we can have our light set up on the proper exposure, as, uh, the proper lighting exposure, as well as what's in the camera. First thing we're going to talk about is the main light which is what I have closest to the subject in this circumstance. Basically, I have this set up with an umbrella on the main light. Then you've heard of other lighting called a softbox. With an umbrella, the light spills over versus a, a softbox. So this is a little bit easier for the beginner. And I, I suggest you start off with uh, an umbrella and build your way up. With a main light, we basically have this facing our subject, and this will provide most of the light direction so we light up this side of the, our subject's face. With our fill light, which I have in the back of the room, same setup, I have the umbrella in it, and the fill light will be a couple of stops, like five, six, and F11 for our main light, the fill light will light up the other side of our subject's face. Two lights, that's all you need to do a basic portrait. You can add other lights, I'm sure you've heard of them, a hair light, a rim light, but with a, a fill light to light up one side, and, and just a subtle hint of the shadow side, and a main light is all you need to do basic studio portraiture. Another key thing too is that I, if you notice I have both lights on the right side. Sometimes you might catch yourself putting a light on the opposite side but then you tend to have a catch light. That's when you see a reflection in your subject's eyes. You want to try to have one catch light or one reflection in your subject's eyes. Proper placement of the main light is pretty important to have this pretty um, level with your subject's eyes or just above so it's at about 10 or 11 o'clock. Uh, a little on the high side but you see that reflection inside my eyes. And if you have both lights on one side, you'll see this light reflection in my eyes and not the backlight. It'll be off to the side, in the back of the room, just filling this side of my face or the subject's face. Of course, I'll be there with the camera in the back photographing you. And that's how you set up basic studio portrait lighting. 